This is the Chrysler Pacifica 2019. Amazing car. And the great thing about this car is that a lot of it is all electric. Doors, the seats, the windows, seats, seven people. Loads of space <coughs> for everything and everyone. Very spacious car. Very nice. Fit all the kids in there. <coughs> but what's even better about this car is that it is a self driving car. What we've got here is the cruise control buttons. What you do when you're driving, obviously, you've got your foot on the accelerator, you press that down. Then you set your speed that you want to travel at. What that will do is a radar and a camera in front of the car and that will lock on to the car in front of you. There isn't one, it will wait until one is. <clears throat> See it there? It will lock in. To the car in front of you and it will self drive and it will brake for you and accelerate for you if you set the speed. It also has lane assist so when you're cruising over the lane it will the steering will actually move back in lane for you so it's pretty much a semi-automatic self-driving car. It does brake really well for you you can go on the highway at 70 miles an hour 80 and it will brake very easily for you so you don't hit cars in front of you whether that's a good thing or not i don't know because you don't have to concentrate so much on driving all you do have to do is keep a hand on the steering wheel or set the alarm off there and it will tell you to put your hand back on the steering wheel and that's what you've got to do you can drive your feet off the pedal and it will accelerate and brake for you it's such a brilliant car You've got the lane assist up there. You've got the uh, traction control. You've got the parking uh, alarm. And you've also there, that is the um, self-drive lane assist. That's the alarm for it. That's to turn it on so it steers for you as well so you don't veer off lane and hit something else. There's radars all around the cars, cameras. Parking's very good. It's quite easy to park. It's keyless. So what you've got on there is this. Now, the clever thing about this is, is that button there, you'll click it twice. And when you're out the car, it will start for you. And you'll have to lock, unlock. And these are the door buttons. So if you're facing the car that way, it's twice for that. And that will open up. Same for the boot as well. You've got a panic alarm, I'm not too sure what that does, I haven't tried that one. But yeah, when all the doors are closed, the car will start. I do like this feature. Let me show you. because I tried to do it when the, when the boot was open but as it did say there it's got remote start as well which is great it's got aircon as usual lots of uh, uh, navigation options it's brilliant We've got loads of things on there to uh, play around with this is a higher car we've got it for two weeks now and uh, pretty much got used to everything on it it's very very good it's also got the 
built in uh, heated seats, heated steering wheel, the U apps, phone, very good climate control. This car is amazing. I'm used to a old Honda 2006 and I jump into this car you know, it's a total world uh, world away from each other really are it's fully automatic with the gears but if you press if you go to L which is the long gear ratio it puts it into a sports mode you've also got the kick down on the accelerator but uh, yeah it makes this car very fast it's a 3.6 V6 <clears throat> That's just a little bit annoying. I get that one there. Size of that bad boy. See the V shape to it there. Mm. A very smooth, quiet engine for the size of it. Fuel economy about 23 miles per gallon, which is not great. As I found out, fuel is cheap over here. Plenty of charge ports, charge your phones up. One, two down there, one there. Headphone jack. Front and rear demister. And yeah, that's basically it. Amazing car. Keyless entry. Keyless start, self driving, super wagon. Love it. Actually, Chrysler Pacifica 2019 3.6 V6. If you get a chance to drive one, do because they're brilliant. And the funny thing is, we've uh, got this car when it's on two and a half thousand miles. Look how many miles we've done it in two weeks. Almost 1,500. We went all around Florida, love it. So yeah, amazing car. Can we get a chance to drive one? Give it a go. There it is. I do love that feature. Remote start. Can you turn it off though? Oh yeah, remote stop. And locks. 10 out of 10. It does a little funny thing when you lock it as well. It's just very helpful when you're parked in a big car park. You don't know where your car is, you just do that. 